If you're new to the idea of minimalism, press pause and I'll put up a definition of what I'm talking about right here. Now that we're ready to move on, one of the things that I find most important to me with minimalism is the amount of clothing I own versus the amount of clothing that I actually use. And I found that the ratio initially was quite off. So what I did starting about two years ago was going through all my clothes and finding what I didn't wear or didn't need, filtering it out, and then just cutting my wardrobe down to the bare essentials that I actually like to wear. I know a lot of other minimalists will reduce to wearing just gray t-shirts and jeans pretty much every day, but I found that's really not the way for me. I still have a bunch of t-shirts and stuff that I really like and I like to style things together and I like to express myself through clothing to some degree. Like I said, this isn't my first time doing this, but I'll be laying out all of my clothes, organizing them, and then filtering out the stuff that I don't like and getting rid of it. And then from there, I'm gonna try and make my wardrobe as small and as functional as I can possibly make it. And with that, here are my stipulations. I'm not counting underwear or socks. I'm not counting specialty gear like winter jackets or rain boots. And then the last thing I'm not including is workout clothes because those need their own separate category for someone who works out a lot. Subtle flex. Time to go grab my laundry and get started. Let's do it. After about 45 minutes, I ended up getting all my clothes sorted out and organized. I removed a few things, and here's all the clothes that I ended up with.
that wraps up my minimal wardrobe. If you guys like this, uh, I encourage you to try it yourself and also check out Minimal's content from Craig Adams or Matt Divea. I'll link them in the description below. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one.